In college, you, you used to. <laughs> Not a lot. Okay, so what do you think about your chances? Um, we have a good team this year, and I think everyone has gelled well. Um, we got some new guys like Taylor right here, who I think the, the vibe of the team has been great, and we've had a couple of tune-ups um, to varying results, but I think it's been mostly positive. There's a lot of optimism with the team this year, and we'll see what we can do. Taylor, what can you say about uh, Isaac's <laughs> optimism about the team? Hey, I'm right there with him. I'm optimistic as well as he is, and. Um, I just echo all the words you said. Um, you know, that just goes to show how you know together we are as a team. We're all on the same page. We all agree that um, we've got work to do, but um, we're positive that we can, you know, allow our work to show, um, let things play out as they will. So we just put our heads down and keep working. So it's been good. They're talking about your athleticism. So oh, you know, let's go. Athleticism. <laughs> Yeah, that left in about the second day after that, <laughs> that is practice of jet lag and trying to dunk everything. But um, no, that's one thing I think I can bring to the table is a little bit of athleticism. Um, you know, hoping that we can play a little more fast pace, so that, fast pace, so that I can display a little bit of that. But um, hoping I can spend some time on the rim this year. That'll be fun. I have no chance with that, so that's all you. <laughs> that is like all. to join like this London contest uh, in the All Star. Uh, the table, right? We'll see. We'll see if uh, the opportunity presents itself. I don't have too much, uh, too many crazy dunks. Keep it simple, but I'll see if Isaac can teach me anything. Oh, uh, you, you. Talk about this guy. Uh, what do you about him? Uh, his and, uh, I think that, skills. I think that's the first thing, guys. That was very evident. Um, we haven't gotten really a chance to watch him play. So on the first day he came, just dunking everything. And we were just like, wow, he's just like dunking everything. And we're like. And then we knew that the second when the second day was gonna come, <laughs> and he got the chop pad on his knee already, got everything. But um, he's the one. I think he's adjusting to the physicality. Um, I think that's what the guards in practice have been doing a good job of, like slowly breaking him into that. So he's gotten more comfortable handling the ball. Um, we're gonna see maybe a lot of point from him this year, maybe in the two. I'm not sure how coach wants to play him, but you expect him. Maybe I think he'll have a couple of highlights this year, a couple of lobs, and he'll be out there. He plays hard. I saw how about you? Uh... Lumps, lumps, but you've been out for a while uh, now. Are you like, are you fitter for the coming season, or uh, how, how are you, right? Definitely. Um, I got to play on tour, and I think I would say that it was kind of rushed. Where I got cleared, when was the on tour? May, May, May on tour. I got cleared maybe uh, start of April. Then we really didn't have time to go to one zero, two one zero. Really, just it was five and zero, then five and five. So. Now I've had a proper off season to kind of build up, get one on one mix, get some two and two, some contact, and my knee feels great. Um, I hope it just holds up and um, just really excited to be out there. And finally, I think it can show a true a little bit more of me. What can you say about uh, Stephen? Does he do this advertising? He is, and I think um, the expectation of what people have of him may be quite unrealistic at this point. Um, we gotta let his game play. Um, but if there's one thing about him, he plays defense, he plays hard. And you know, like I was joking around with people like when the first few practice came in and Holt was running through screens and me and I was like, damn, like I feel him, like he's running through screens, he's staying in front of guys. Uh, maybe the shot hasn't fall, fallen yet. I think the first couple of days struggled a little bit, but we've seen him in practice where there was one time where um, we were shooting for ball and it was him versus Wami and they went like eight, nine, ten straight consecutive and we were just watching them. So uh, he's someone who's gonna. I think people have expectations of him. I don't know what, how high it is, um, with certain people, but he's going to deliver. No, I agree. I agree. One thing that um, we're hoping to get from him, obviously, he's a great shooter, is a little more aggressiveness. You know, stepping into the role in this team as a primary scorer is going to be big um, because he's such a threat um, outside, and we obviously have a threat down low with Thomas, our big and. You know, Isaac can do both, so um, I call him Jokic for a reason, he can do both, but um, definitely I'm excited to play with Steven, um, Isaac talked about his defense, um, offensively he'll get out and run the floor, hoping to hit ahead and get some transition by Reese, but um, it's all going to fall into place, we're all getting used to each other, being new guys, being rookies, and um, so far so good, so we're just going to build one day at a time. How about Kmart, uh, getting that oh. another big... Um, I think that was always the. Um, we lost, um, of course, uh, Gabayni last season, and I think that was always the thing that we needed more bigs because for some reason, we could never stay 
um, healthy. I think we could never get complete. So now having Kmar come in, um, I think we will provide shot blocking because as you see, me, Eric, Aldich aren't really bigs who get up there and challenge shots. We're more of stay in front, keep it on the ground. But So now the coaches can now get creative with their defense, allowing him to go chase shots, go get shots. And he's shown that in our practices that he's able to stretch the floor, be able to be that other stretch big to give Thomas, give Guami, give our other guards some space to operate. And I think that we're seeing that what he's learned from his overseas and PBL and all the other leagues, um, that he's quite ready and that he's ready to perform. He's ready to perform. How about the new uniforms? Looks like LaSalle. <laughs> <laughs> um, but of course, we're just excited to have a new jersey every year. And um, of course, our new sponsor, Ant Box. Our new outfit is our Ant Box. Um, but it does really look reminiscent of the 2000s LaSalle teams. And nakangating nga ako eh. Hindi ako sanayin na naka-green eh. Um, and lolokoin ko si Mami Mami at hindi siya sanayin mag-green eh. But I mean, it's one thing having it on, putting it on. One thing now, we kind of we get on the floor and play. Thank you.